Hello, you're watching Eric Dieter's World News. This is Jamie Spinley with the latest headlines. A volcano has erupted on the Renekes Peninsula of southwest Iceland after weeks of intense earthquake activity. About 4,000 people were evacuated from the fishing town of Grindjavik earlier this month and a nearby Blue Lagoon geothermal spa was closed. It is not expected to bring the same level of destruction as the one in 2010, which halted all European air travel. An explosion and a fire at Guinea's main fuel depot rocked the port of the capital Konkani earlier morning, killing at least 13 people and seriously injuring 88 more, according to authorities. The cause of the blast is currently un unclear, with officials saying the scale and consequences could have direct impact on the population. At least 118 people were killed and more than 500 were left injured after a 6.2 magnitude earthquake in northwest China late last night. And attacks on commercial ships in the Red Sea risk pushing up the price of oil and other goods analysts have warned. Several firms have poor shipments through the route after vessels were attacked by Houthi rebels in Yemen. The world's second largest shipping line said on Tuesday that it would reroute some other vessels around the African Cape of Good Hope. That's the latest headlines until tomorrow from the team and I. Cheerio.